Um, so initially when I started, uh, I, di I didn't really know who Ayana Koto was. And my lecturer had requested that I go shoot the funeral of this man, you know, who I had no idea who he was. And upon shooting his uh, funeral, I realized the impact that he had made on the community. And so I think me seeing that kind of triggered my interest in pursuing his story even further than what I had already known. Ayanda Kota was born in Makanda in the year 1976. Kota dedicated his life to advocating for the rights of underprivileged individuals, primarily in Makanda and also Cape Town. His impactful work resonates across the nation. He attended Nomulelo Secondary School in Joza location at the age of 15, where he then became involved in the Black Consciousness Movement, which was initiated by Steve Biko in the 1970s. In 1995, Kota would later then be chosen as the chairperson of the Azanian student movement in Cape Town. Oh, my name is Ayanda Kota from the Unemployed People's Movement. I think it's important for people to meet, uh, uh, take stock of things, uh, reflect, and, uh, and, and, and resonate. And uh, so I think, and, and take that space very seriously in terms of thinking. Uh, all the challenges that are facing humanity, that are facing the residents of Makan. So that's what I think. And uh, now we cannot preempt, but I hope that some of the decisions and, uh, that are taken here, some of the inputs that we are making here, uh, are inputs that will be able to, to pave and, uh, some way for us and that uh, to take this matter forward. A man deeply rooted in the heart of Makanda, known to many as the voice. Kota was more than just an activist. He was a father, a friend, a neighbor, an ordinary man with an extraordinary drive to make a difference. Oh, I and I believed in that uh, philosophy of of, of, of black consciousness. That black men you are on your own. And, and you can do things yourself. You know, the philosophy of um, Oprah Steve or Miko um, or Malu Simpumlan and a lot of others, you know. Um, it's amazing that he, and I, he was able to grapple with that at a very young age. People of cities' dignity has been forfeited by this municipality. All that they do is thieving. All they do is being corrupt. They don't care for anyone. So they must go. <laughs> We want the Premier, this is the board of no confidence. It is not the first of no confidence. These people signed 22. 22,000 of these people signed a petition or a, sign, a petition that said that council must go. What else people must do? What else people must do for them to understand that we don't want them, that we reject them, that they must go. They must go. When I'm full, I'm to on a chair or in a seat. I'm to pine gel. I'm to go pine gel. I'm to go in a pine gel. I'm to jalo. I'm to fikele lega. I'm to want. And I'm going to get no door to door. I'm full of con. But when they can do any app, in do any no quasi pill. Any no yenza. The pint tinipi. I put iron like a log. Sometimes I'm going to go to the bank. We because because we go to go see 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 
ebefikelele ke buntwaneni efikelele ka kubuntu bokukhulu kumaxhakwazi befikelele ka umama uka umama ku umama umpepho ebe sithi nobe nje kwembizi athi Gladys imi ngumuntu omhanzi ofikelele kayo ebe inkokheli ayanda kuthi we speak to Ayanda Gota, founding member of the Unemployed People's Movement, on the economic impact of the unemployment rate on younger people. Ayanda, good evening and thank you very much for your time. You know, we often hear of the high cost of youth unemployment, but perhaps on a more surface level. But you work closely with the youth. Just take us through the real daily impact of high levels of youth unemployment. In the shadow of apartheid's end, Millions in South Africa still grapple with poverty and unemployment. This harsh reality lay the groundwork for a new kind of resistance, the Unemployed People's Movement. UPM was established in 2009 uh, here in Grahamstown. It was a resolution on our side to overcome political apathy, to overcome resignation, uh, to overcome uh, the demobilization of 1994, 27th of April, because that uh, to us uh, was the day in which our people were sent to the caves, our people were depoliticized uh, under the pretext of freedom. The Unemployed People's Movement has emerged as a beacon of hope for the people of Makanda. It is the beating heart of Makanda, pumping life into the community that might otherwise falter, sustaining hope and resilience through its relentless political pulse. Oh, I saw some challenges and he felt that something in my neck I Then I had a woman in color and doing consultation. Smiles in the table and I was going to go to This is where it all started, really. By it talks, some no I had a good thing I was going to do. Since the city by a boy from Cape Town, I won't buy a good thing. His enthusiasm changed and we realize how good there are lots of informal settlements. Is 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 like you, but time on the bomba corner, I feel she ain't at hand. So I'm a little bit more than if we're not in. So we we believe we are a resisting movement. We are a fighting movement. We are a grassroots movement. So. We believe that the struggles that we have uh, uh, taken a decision, a conscious decision to engage ourselves in, it's a struggle, uh, it's a struggle that we are going to win. Uh, if the people of this country did defeat apartheid, uh, we believe that even the oppressive regime of the ruling party ANC, the people will also win. And people of, uh, always win. And now, and now. the <laughs> Ungum to only a tire, sobo loba. I can fund on a pangeli, Wenza, Gantela Zoink, about to make a pangel and Obupangel, whom seven soon chan. Who put Ayanda, a cabafuna banda banga, US school win. We are the most banana basal barbo, who tell him that I found, I made a pack was made a coin. Who put Ayanda got a baker as the Ikumbu, we come to the monument. As a cope, Ikumbi, as a tata band, MK Nabapinda Babuis, and the Kepayan Babaki Sarak. My fault and Abuki social media is like Facebook. 
bafote ba bonus ba aya ndakoto ukuba khuphe then kwenzeka ntoni nabasi bonus ba ekunjani bese besenza ntoni monument yabo so at least besebenza yena besebenza sana sake besisibona because most abantu bafumene pha emaphepheni because of aya ndakoto bathathu bathatha ahambe nabo bonke aba bantu bebemane bathatha apho abalandi kwa bafunela umsebenzi pha emonument baphange I'm not sure whether you you knew that there was a time when he was feeding the community people that are hungry you know literally hungry I'm not speaking about people that are hungry spiritually I'm speaking about people that needed to have food babeke tafleni badle abantu abafite because they had nothing else Under Kota's leadership, the unemployed people's movement made a difference in the lives of many. The movement stepped in to provide crucial support to where it was needed most, including paying for students stationery, funding funerals, providing food parcels, and covering the cost of groceries for families struggling during the height of the COVID-19 pandemic. The organization also took a strong stand against gender-based violence, advocating for the protection and empowerment of vulnerable individuals in the community. Ayanna Kota's tireless efforts through the UPM left a lasting legacy of compassion and solidarity. Ayanna Kota's resolve was forged in the fires of betrayal. The ANC once a symbol of hope had become a fortress of corruption. No longer would he stand by in silence. He knew the dangers, the threats that lurked in the shadows for those who dared to speak out. But fear had no place here. Ayanda was ready to confront the ANC, knowing the risks, yet undeterred. The time for action had come. And we will continue to say, this is not our seat. This is their shield. We denounce the African National Congress and their government for the protection of information bill. We denounce the African National Congress and their government because today they are siding with bosses. The bosses are inflating the prices of staple food, including bread, that we cannot afford. We have no one to stand for us and we have no one to defend us. Today, we have gathered here to say we are denouncing the party of the elite. Welcome to your daytime update. Now, tell us about the Matana Citizens Fund. Uh, who are you and what led to your formation? Well, I think the big question that we should be asking ourselves uh, is does the local government in South Africa do what it meant to do? That, that means, is it accountable to the citizen? Um, is it run democratically by politicians? And, and, and the answer to that is big no. Under the banner of UPM, the Sibane meetings, Ufman's good Aban, Esiamba, we area, Samba, for UPM stand. In fact, Bafunu I had to be the mayor of Makand. Um, so, as 
But when I told you law is for UPM, as far as we stand up, because it is our change. So UPM, we have been working in the in UPM. So UPM, as far as we change, my son is UPM, but rather UPM, if for me, she kind of a baby. Then we're not now. We're formation. We're back. We're going to be not now. We're going to be formation. We're going to be stand. The Makana Citizens Front quickly became a powerful voice in local politics, drawing attention to the failures of government. However, as the movement gained momentum, a leadership struggle emerged, culminating in a bitter court case. Towards the end of Ayanda's life, the UPM was part of the establishment of the MCF, the Makana Citizens Front, which basically immediately factionalized and broke down immediately after the elections. So, you know, that there are now two factions. This battle threatened to fracture the very coalition that sought to bring change to Makanda. Ayanda Kota, a key figure in the UPM and MCF, has long been recognized for his relentless activism and leadership. Yet within the MCF, some factions began to question his leadership, even discrediting the work he had done. People, he loved the people. And I believe that in his, his party uh, is, is beginning to, to splinter. The same thing that I warned him about. That was a favorite then the tea fell in, you think that he could shall then again go to the lash. And Ilika second book, Ayanda is a whole country. And I wonder who's going to take the baton. And go twenty twenty two, go April. As I'm speaking to you, I'm a lawfully legitimate MCF leader. You can go to the website of the IEC, check who is the legitimate leader of the MCF. It's me. So, we are expecting those two possibilities, and the judge may say, we are pleased with us, and thereafter, uh, only later date will give this business. So at least the time shut down If Ayanda for spokesperson during shut down, Gengazangi Glungeto Nango Nike, Wayanda, why a corn, a swell in the bang of an beco chin, Jemakand. Mm. 
I've always said to him, I pray for him more than I pray for myself. We know she has born in those regions. We must be a temper, the tiny man, the ambinda, a Christmas thousand with a color. Then you pin the bonny right, a pin the pipe in the lend to pin one by Ibuza Matakala. So Dianda and Dandy Dandy Hedge was in the garden and it's going abandoned. Ba abandoned about Kelly Tatabo and if I under Uno Sueleka, Dandinaland, if Uno Sueleka and the Zautin, a banduanin. Although in years in Dubangabana, the Dingumama, Dingumama, oh, 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 because I don't know to send his plans uh, for a future. And it's in the dreams, but I'm out. Neat. After this, neat, neat. So, I don't know what to do. It dreams is it to the all shop. Because it is all loser. It is all yakelela. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I don't know As we speak now, Wayana has left a, a, a very gaping hole. Um, 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 adding a bonio in the banana was a valeganja at his young age, you know, for this community. Where uh, Yasemakanda. I'm the guy in Temba. No two come there to. I live here to put his own gear up again down. No two come there to go back to Loko. We see him as he banins. Can't see him as he park. Bunga kuzuti. One that give a go a pito pito. Yeah, it's petrol plastic. Better be nice. Captain is it. So I'm gonna see what Luke. He's your park a park a Loki. But soup kitchen ya kebika Loki. Best park a park. So I'm going to ask science. Can I learn your best parties, Captain? See business. I'm asking. Then he's your park. Ask science in Ireland. So I can go to see last year. Loki on the stand is pure science. So shall I go It's been really bad ever since a, ever since the Swelly Gay. Because Nella Clash of Essay Corner. Kella Clash of Essay Corner, when the Asba, a corner meeting. Utewell <laughs> Ichinche <laughs> Ich 
Yeah, I can't